know my job on the team. Uh, whenever my minutes are there, I got to produce for the team. Whenever I get my opportunities on both ends, meaning like positioning wise for those boards, then I I have to do a better job each game to get put myself in those positions to get the get, to get those rebounds for this team. So. I think it comes with a mindset first. That's where it all starts. Whenever you have a good mindset, uh, the leadership is there. It really helps my game as well as our, our whole team. So whenever our leaders step up early and set the tone for our team, we usually do really well. So, I guess what, what do you remember from him last year and the way he's developed? Uh, they have a, a lot of good players. Uh, we have to look at the film and see, but they're a dangerous team. Uh, they're a great team. Uh, this league is hard. Everybody is good in this league. So we got a chance to win a road game, and it starts today with preparation. Tariq, I guess just from Oklahoma State, what have you seen from them and what they've been able to do with their post players? Um, you know, so far, uh, you know, just, just like Norris said, they're a really good team. It's the Big 12. Um, you know, everybody has – Everybody has a pretty good team. So um, it's just going to come down to the preparation, um, you know, just how we game plan against them. You're the old pro in the Big 12, and you had a lot of, you've been on teams that have had a, a lot of success with consecutive games, four, five game win streak, four game win streak. Do you feel like this team's starting to get their stride in Big 12 play now as, as you get to the second half of Big 12 play? I mean, I sure hope so. We'll, we'll see with this week. But it's great to have a week where we, we play well and we get win, wins. Uh, definitely gives us confidence, our young guys' confidence, knowing that it's just showing us what we can do if we play the right way each day. starts with leadership, and we just got to stay consistent. It's the biggest thing for us. No, it's different from week to week for both of you guys. We'll start with Tariq. Uh, what what specifically do you think you guys did well last week compared to uh, the rough patch that you guys had a couple of weeks ago? Um, uh, the main thing is uh, we you know we stuck to the process. Uh, you know everybody continued to work. Uh, we didn't let it phase us. Um, you know everybody every team has adversity this time of the season. So um, I feel like we did a great job of sticking through it, staying together as a team, staying close, um, and really just fighting through it. Um, you know the main the main thing was uh, the energy level that we came out with to start these games. Uh, you know, we came out we're aggressive as a team, so um, I think that really helped us. Uh, just attention to detail, knowing that you can't take days for granted, uh, you can't take practices for granted. Moments in practice where you think something's not going the way it should, our leadership has to take over and and help our team push past those things. And that, that translated to the games last week, which allowed us to win. So as long as our leadership and our core stays tight, uh, the other guys will follow and we'll do well. Coach mentions that on a regular basis, his confidence in you know, most of you guys and Brandon Francis as well. How much different is this team when Brandon has things clicking on the offensive end? Uh, he's a spark plug. He gives a lot of energy. He, he obviously a lot of passion, but when he's right, it, it really propels our team to the next level. Uh, he gives, he's a guy that can play defense. He's a guy that can score for us. He's a guy that just mostly brings it and, and uplifts other guys on the team. So whenever he's right, uh, we're, we're as good as anybody.